The 1983 TAA Giangoa Airlines Boeing 737 crash occurred just after a Boeing 737-200 took off from Lubango Airport at Lubango, Angola, on a regular domestic flight, flight number DT-462, to Quattro de Fevereiro Airport in Luanda on November 8, 1983. The aircraft had 126 passengers and four crew on board. Topic aircraft The aircraft involved was a one-year-old Boeing 737-2M2 registration D2TBN, factory number 22775, and serial number 869 that had its first maiden flight on April 29, 1982 and was delivered to TAAG Angola Airlines on May 6 the same year. The aircraft was powered by two Pratt & Whitney JT-8D17 turbofan engines. Topic. Crash The aircraft was at 200 feet 61 meters and climbing when it began to descend and turn left. The left wingtip hit the ground, and the aircraft broke apart and burst into flames. The wreckage came to rest 800 meters 2, feet from the end of the runway at Lubango Airport. The crash killed all 130 people on board. Topic. Cause UNITA guerrillas claimed to have shot down the aircraft, which they believed to be carrying only military personnel, with a surface-to-air missile to protest Angola's government. Post-crash investigation of the aircraft's wreckage by the Angolan authorities revealed no conclusive evidence of missile damage, and the cause of the crash is officially considered to be a mechanical failure. <laughs> 